In our high school geometry course, sometimes we are asked to do a translation. The way to do a translation is this. We look at our situation, we have a shape that has to be moved, and we have a translation line which shows the length and the direction of the translation. We start by measuring the translation line. This one is eight and a half centimeters long. We move the ruler so that it is zeroed on the closest vertex, and we swivel the ruler until the edge of the ruler is parallel to the translation line. And then we draw a line eight and a half centimeters long. Starting from A, I am ending at A prime. Going to the next closest vertex, we do the same thing. Zero the ruler, make sure the edge of the ruler is parallel to the translation line. And this is easier now because we have this line to help us judge the parallelism, one we drew. We have the original and we also have the other edge of the ruler. Once you're satisfied that they're parallel, you draw your eight and a half centimeter line. It started from B, so it ends at B prime. Now going to C, I'm doing the same thing. Zero it, judge that the ruler is parallel, draw an eight and a half centimeter line, call it C prime. And now vertex D, same thing. Zero, judge parallelism, eight and a half centimeter line, ends around here, call it D prime. Got a little messy there, but now all I have to do is connect the dots and shape A, B, C, D has now been translated or slid along the paper eight and a half centimeters and in the direction dictated by the translation line. Let's go to this example with triangle DEF. It works the same way. I measure this translation line and I say that is 4.9 centimeters long. Closest vertex is D. I zero it, I judge parallelism, and I go 4.9 centimeters, and that's my D prime. Now I'm going to E, zero it, judge that it's parallel, 4.9 centimeters, that's my E prime, and now F, zero, judge parallelism, 4.9 centimeters, call it F prime, and then just connect the dots. I can't draw, but these diagrams make it look like I can. In PQRS, the translation line is 5.8 centimeters long, and I'm using the same technique, 5.8 centimeters, S prime, Q, 5.8 centimeters, Q prime, P, 5.8 centimeters, P prime, and R, 5.8 centimeters, R prime. Now I connect the dots. R to S, R prime to S prime, S prime to P prime, P prime to Q prime, and Q prime back to R prime. Translation of 5.8 centimeters. In the last example, I have this little triangle TUV. The translation line is 4 centimeters long. Zero it, parallel, 4 centimeters. Started from T, so I call this T prime. Now I'm going to do U, zero it, four centimeters. That's U prime. Now V, zero it, four centimeters. 
the prime and I connect the dots. And my triangle T prime, U prime, V prime looks like a four centimeter translation of triangle T U V. This is how you do a translation. It's time to do a few of your own examples for practice.